Well, the last place Yankees are in town this weekend, which probably has a nice ring to it, but New York is still six games above 500, despite being in the cellar in the AL East. So Baltimore will need to find a way to turn things around after dropping two of three up in Philly. We're breaking down the three-game weekend series here at the PNC Digital Desk. PNC Bank helping to make a difference. Last time out, the Orioles offense couldn't find enough juice in a 6-4 loss to the Phillies. Adley Rutschman had a three-run home run in the third inning, but the Phillies responded. Two runs apiece in the second, third, and seventh frames proved to be enough. Orioles hitters combined for 11 strikeouts on the day. And the Yankees come to town, winners of four of their last five. They just split the two-game Subway Series against the Mets. And Aaron Judge could be making his return this weekend. So despite the standings, still a lot of firepower to worry about. A player to watch for the Orioles, how about Ryan O'Hearn? An amazing story all year long. Whether he's in the starting lineup or not, he's been a valuable piece. Over his last five games, just 11 at-bats, but four hits with a double and two home runs in some clutch spots. He's been huge for Brandon Hyde all season long. On the mound tonight, it's Grayson Rodriguez against Garrett Cole. Rodriguez has looked a lot better since his return from AAA Norfolk. Went five and two-thirds with just two earned runs and six strikeouts against the Rays in his last appearance. And for Cole, he's been, well, Garrett Cole. A 278 ERA with 10 strikeouts per nine on the season. But he did have his worst start of the year against the Orioles back in May. That just about does it here from the PNC Digital Desk. PNC Bank, helping to make a difference.